Today we will discuss about max and min instruction in Mitsubishi PLC FX5. Let's understand the use of this instruction by an example. Suppose you have an application of position versus torque in which you have stored 10 values of torque at different positions for one cycle. Now you want to check that what is the maximum and minimum value of torque for the stored values. You can check maximum and minimum values by using max and min instruction respectively. Along with this, by using max and min instruction, you can also get count of minimum and maximum value present in your stack. Now M0 as max enable bit using MAX instruction mm, with the, the 10,000 tabs as our stack value and this one is 10 as our result and K10 so D1000 is starting address of stack D10 is our result max result you can say Here what will happen is that the max instruction will only search for the maximum value between D10,000 D1000 to D1009. Now the same with the min instruction. Let's write M1 as min enable. Okay. And MIN as instruction D10 as D20 as a result and K10. K10 is number of uh, values means from 1000 to 1009 that equals 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 7, 8, 9. Okay. It will be an IN result. Okay, so let's first convert and rebuild the program. Okay, now as let's run the simulator here, start the simulator. Now we will use watch one window to monitor the instruction. Thousand, thousand one, one thousand and two, thousand and three, one thousand and four, thousand five, thousand and six, sorry, D one thousand and seven, D one thousand and eight, D one thousand and nine. Now D ten, D twenty. M0 M1 So suppose uh, our values which we obtained was 12 15 14 15 8, 19 20 again 12 and uh, 88 and uh, 13 and uh, 15 or say 16 and uh, 20 Okay First, uh, let's change this one also. This will let it be 20, sorry. Or you can, yeah, it's only okay, 30. Now, let me on this bit. So, in the D10, we can see that the value is 20, which we obtained from this and this. Now, just in 11. D12, D13, D14, and D21, D22, D24. <coughs> we can also enable min instruction here. For the minimum value is 12, and the maximum value is 20. 
okay in d11 we can see here we have 5 what this 5 actually means let's see in manual This is the max instruction. So, first is the maximum value, then the position, then number of data. Number of positions. That is five. Position is five. One, two. 3, 4, 5. 5 is the number and this is 2. That means we have 2 value present. Now let's change the 13 to 20 and the value here 2 must be 3 because we have 3 max values that is 20, 20, 20 at 3 times. So here we have 3. Now suppose this value changes to here that's 20 also. Then the first value which we have obtained, the maximum value which we have obtained in stack one is on number number three, and we have total four number of maximum values. That is two, one, two, three, and one, two, three, four. Yes, four is four values, and this is the maximum and this is the minimum value. Now the same things happens in minimum instruction. In minimum instructions, we have twelve here and here so the position is first position and we have total number of two values so here we can see one that is the position of first minimum value and we have total two minimum values that is the thousand and the thousand and five now if we changes change the value here 12 and uh, write it here write in 11 19 and uh, here also 12 then you can see the first position of minimum value that is 12 is on third number 1 2 3 and the max uh, the values uh, the number of values we have obtained are 3 that means 12 1 2 and 3 so this is all about the max and min instruction uh, you can use in uh, i mean many of the applications according to what you have uh, 